Hey everybody! Well, today we're going to take a look at this brand new ornament from Hallmark. Now, yes, I know it's only July of 2023, and here we are talking about Christmas already. <laughs> but uh, Hallmark already has their ornaments out, and this one was really cool. I couldn't resist it. So this is a Star Wars themed one. This is the uh, Into the Carbonite Freezing Chamber. And it's got the whole scenario of when uh, in Empire Strikes Back, uh, Han Solo gets frozen in carbonite. It's a really cool... Um, animated thing over here. I mean, it has just a couple of moving parts. So this is what the back of it looks like. Now this uh, retails for $65. It's not the cheapest thing, but a lot of Hallmark stuff is pretty pricey. Now the thing about this is you are going to need one of these. This is the keepsake power cord. You're going to need one of these to power this up. This isn't a battery powered thing. And um, I don't know if there's a substitute you can use. These are about $15 and that's because you can power more than just one ornament with that. So this is what you get with the power cord. You get the main power jack. Quite a long uh, cord, which is very good. This is the power jack here that plugs into this. You get all of these. So this will plug into this part right here, like that. And then it powers up up to seven different ornaments. So you can see all the little power jacks right here. They plug into seven different ornaments. So with one cord, you can power up quite a few of those. So that's why that's $15. I don't know, if, like I said, I don't know if there's another equivalent you can buy for this. I doubt it, since this is specifically made for the Hallmark ornaments. So it's worth getting one of these if you're going to have a lot of the different ornaments that they make. All right, and here is the ornament, and I've already got it plugged in. Now, when you first plug it in, the lights will come on, and it kind of goes to like a little diagnostic with the movement that we'll see in the middle right there and then it resets itself. But here you can see what it looks like. This thing is so beautiful. I absolutely love this. It looks just like that set that was in the movie. You can see how it's kind of pulsating and see the little white lights showing up inside the, the uh, carbonite pit area. Look at all this beautiful detail on the side here. They really went all out on this. Hallmark is always known for its really well done details on a lot of their stuff, not only their ornaments, but some of their other stuff. This is really nice looking. You can see the nice lights on the side right there. Little vents or something. Some tubing, piping, looks like some kind of tanks. Really well done. That looks so cool. Then on the back, that's where that plugs in. You get a really nice cord, a long cord for this, which is really good. There you can see the steps. They're lit up as well. We have Darth Vader himself, the sinister Dark Lord. Ha <laughs> ha There he is. Then we see poor Han Solo about ready to meet his carbonite fate right there. <laughs> then we have 3PO in his uh, all dismembered basket, little netting right there that we saw in the movie where Chewbacca is carrying him around. And there's Chewbacca and poor Princess Leia. Sad that she knows that poor Han Solo is about to be frozen in carbonite. Very nicely done. Look at how cool this looks. And I'll show you a little bit more of what's going on down inside there. I love the lighting effect. It's great. Absolutely great. Okay, so let me turn this on and I'll show you what it does because it's really cool. All right, so here we go. Start this up. What if he doesn't survive? He's worth a lot to me. The Empire will compensate you if he dies. Put him in. <laughs>
that is so cool. That is so cool. Love it, and look at how it resets. When it's done, it resets, and you can see how this works down here. It's just got a couple of little elevators inside there that are synced. And the motor is very quiet. It's a very quiet motor in there, so you can kind of see what's going on. That is really awesome. And it was a nice long, uh, you know, they put the whole scene in there. Sometimes they don't always do that. Usually they'll just put the part where he goes in there. So that's really great. That is so cool. Ah, oh, man. This could be one of Hallmark's best ornaments so far. Wow, <laughs> this is so cool. I absolutely love this thing. I saw it at the Hallmark store a couple weeks ago, and I had to wait till today. So I'm filming this video on July 15th of 2023. That's when these um, Hallmark ornaments were released. I got to the store, and there was already a line outside the door. I was like, wow. I didn't realize these were so popular. There's a lot of collectors out there that like this stuff, myself included. And so when I saw that line, I was like, ah, oh, great. They're going to be sold out by the time I get inside to get one of these because they don't have a whole lot of shelf space in that store that I'm at, that I go to. Uh, thankfully, I got in there. They had one left. This was the last one. I was lucky to get it. I couldn't believe it. I was so fortunate to get this thing. So um, $65 is what this retails for. And then if you need the power cord, that's going to be an additional $15. So it's about $80. For the whole thing um, you know I know it's kind of pricey but you can keep these ornaments for years and years um, and I think a lot of people probably have Star Wars trees or Star Trek trees and <laughs> I love that I think it's really awesome this is such a cool looking ornament and I just love the action features in it I'd say this one kind of rivals last year's uh, uh, to the Bat Cave from Batman was it last year or the year before I don't know I did a video on that and that one uh, that particular ornament is kind of collectible now because it was discontinued early on because there was something wrong with the mechanism for the doors. You can check that video out. I did a whole review on it and I discuss it in there. So I, this one kind of is in that same uh, you know area of, of ornaments but hopefully that motor will last a good long time. There's not a whole lot that has to move around in there so that's probably a good thing. All right, well, this is very cool. I absolutely love it. If you want to get one of these, you can go to the Hallmark store if they got them in stock, or just go to the Hallmark website and just order it. That's probably the easiest way. And um, get yourself one of these awesome Han Solo and Carbonite freezing chamber. All right, so I'll play it one more time so you can watch it again. Um, this time I'll keep the phone on the tripod. That way you can kind of watch it. I wanted to zoom in the first time to the characters, but this way you can kind of uh, watch it with a more steady hand. <laughs> survive. He's worth a lot to me. The Empire will compensate you if he dies. Put him in. Stop, Chewie! Stop! 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 Listen to me! Stop. Yes, stop, please! I'm not ready to die! Hey! Hey! Listen to me! Chewie! Chewie, this won't help me! Hey! Save your strength. There'll be another time. The princess, you have to take care of her. You hear me? Huh? I love you. I know. Absolutely love it. You know, I do wish they might have had Boba Fett over here, just because you can hear him talk briefly with Darth Vader. So that would have been kind of cool. I like the way it resets right here. <laughs> That's so cool. 
All right, well, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. I very much appreciate it, and until the next video, I will see you then, so thank you very much for watching, and have a good one.